top bro crowd. Oh, it's your boy. It's your cousin. It's your baby mom's favorite wrestler. It is the Grappler region's best kept secret. It's the leader of the Duffin Season Nation, the innovator of Duffin Season. Ladies and gentlemen. What? It is. Let me introduce to you my friends. Introducing Ooh. first. That's the energy I'm on today. Introducing oh, oh, we first. Doing that today. Okay. All <laughs> right. He's the man that runs this podcast. All right. I don't really do anything but clearly pick fights with my friends. All right. Ladies and gentlemen, it is the Red Dog. Yeah, it's the Air Force Center Intel Specialist, the one you call on when you need to get the job done. And his last episode here in Baltimore, Maryland. I don't want to talk about I, that. Uh, I find, until I find my until I find my new one. And the main pusher of pure ignorance. Mm. Me. <laughs> Y'all some niggas. Sorry, excuse my language. <laughs> Thank you. Oh wow. Wow. Okay. <laughs> All right. All right, there's the symbiote. Um <laughs> yeah. Introducing next, he is the evil one. He is very, very evil. He is a supervillain himself. Ladies and gentlemen, Master Xehanort, okay, right there in the flesh. All right, for all my Kingdom Hearts fans, all right? He, is, he was there for the very first wrestling match, all right? He's over 17,000 years old, okay? He had a pet T-Rex named Chubby. Ladies and gentlemen, Damien Fatal. All right, I want you to look at the back of my shirt. Uh, okay. Hold it, hold it. What does that say? What is that? That says Duffin, Duffin season. <laughs> Established <laughs> when? Established <laughs> when? <laughs> it's, uh, That's not fair because oh. that was that copyright is out of date. It says 91. <laughs> exactly. Which we think it's the year 91. Not, Don't I, matter. Know, That's, no, it the was year 91. It was point nine one. It's not even year one yet. It was <laughs> We, we, this is right there. No, it's out of date. We got new copyright laws. Oh, that's nice. be I, first. <laughs> I, got, I got that grandfather clause, that great grandfather clause. <laughs> she meant, she meant, well, that absolute grandfather clause. It's like you old the, fir- the first grandfather clause. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> He said, "He said when Adam had his kid, that's my grandfather Claus." <laughs> there you go. Hey, yo, no, there you go. Hey yo, you the wilding. Anyway, uh, that first kid wasn't even Adam's. Uh, oh, anyway, <laughs> follow us on social media. That don't right. make no sense. There's only <laughs> two of them. So it doesn't exactly. It doesn't make sense, and that's why we're not even going to acknowledge he said it. Follow what us. You mean? All right. No. Because it no. He, 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 he was getting busy with a snake. Nah, I mean. <laughs> no. At least that's what. At no. least that's what they tell you. Oh my gosh. <laughs> <laughs> Is it really an apple then? <laughs> nope. Um, <laughs> yeah, he's like trying to get through the intro. It's not happening. All right, go ahead. My bad. My bad. My bad. You go ahead. Go ahead. Continue. Follow us, guys. Yeah. Um, yeah, right, there. Media, yeah, right there, social media <laughs> three count underscore pod on Twitter and three count pod everywhere else. Hit that bell button on YouTube. All right, <laughs> thank you to our live watchers right now. We're, uh, we're streaming live on Facebook, uh, YouTube, Twitch, and Twitch. And I think is there something else, right? No, uh, no, not right now, right not now, right now, just in those two right now, <laughs> but we are okay. set up for kick, so soon you guys will see us on kick as well. Oh, and shit. also for our audio listeners. Uh, give us that like on uh, on Spotify. Hit that five star frog splash review off of the Great Wall of China. I didn't have nothing set up this week. I see that. So then, I, I did. We Damn, did. We right, yeah, all right. Yeah, you dropped. Yeah, you dropped down a little bit. Yeah, I mean the Eiffel Tower. I couldn't think of uh, what was bigger at the time. You know, uh, off the Chrysler Building. There we go. Yeah, hit him like Ocean Gate. <laughs> Oh. 
Why? Will something happen? Just please, just follow <laughs> us. Give us a five star. I'm on. Give us four at least. Ooh. Give us four. I'll be. I, 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 listen. I'll manage with I, four. <laughs> yeah, four and a half. Listen, four and a half. I don't know if you guys knew this or not, right? Like, I know it is like a wrestling side, but uh, I don't know if you guys knew. But Ocean Gate, after all this, all this stuff happened, they put out an application. Yeah. To <laughs> request another a senior technician. Like, come on, man. Well, like, I'm gonna take hey. the job. Yeah. I mean, <laughs> obviously, they'll hire anybody. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, I mean, it's not explosive, they, so you're fine. They gotta there you it. go. Hey, just because he, just because they died, don't mean they gotta stop making money. <laughs> I mean, <laughs> that, well, they're gonna lose a lot of money, man. Yes, <laughs> I mean, they yes, are. Man. Yes, they yeah. are. But they say, hey, business gotta keep going. Yeah, it is. It's crazy. <laughs> that is crazy. So it's, it like, is cra- no, it's crazy. I, it's like that's and that's the craziest thing is that's that is the worst thing I heard. But I don't know if you guys saw like the news. Last week, because we didn't get a chance to talk about this, and I, I kind of want to bring this up on here about the manager, and I think it was in Tennessee that walked into a dude's room and started sucking his toes while he was asleep. Wait, what? oh, oh, yeah. wow, oh, <laughs> that's a thing oh. that happened, man. This man is in jail right now, twenty thousand dollars bond. Like, yo, Ooh. it was wild. I was hearing about all sorts of crazy stuff. I was like, wow, <laughs> I don't do feet. <laughs> No, yeah, neither, neither no, no that's 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 nasty. That's nasty. That's, 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 he that's, he needs to go to jail forever. No, he need to be locked up in in like with padded walls and a straight jacket. <laughs> um, yeah. Need like, a hug from yeah. mom. So you guys get lessons in current history uh, in current news as well as whatever else we're going to talk about today. Right. You're welcome. Back to that. Back. Back, to our, back to that uh, podcast thing we do. Right. Yeah. Wrestling. <laughs> Debate show, right? <laughs> so, uh, yeah, yeah, by this time, if you didn't subscribe or follow us or anything, you're probably not going to. You're just probably going to listen to this episode, and that's fine, too. But you're going to do it now. Exactly. So, But thank you for joining us as we uh, argue about wrestling. So with that being said, let's get right down to it. Oh, uh, it starts in 30 minutes. <laughs> it does. It, well, no. It's an hour and 30 minutes. Hour and 30 no, minutes. The, I'm talking about the, the – the, Oh, yeah, the, uh, yeah, the, the pre-show. Yeah, yeah, I just, yeah, I just got a notification. Oh, haha. Buying. So, let's go. Let's get right ah. into it. We'll get back to everything else because this is what we were talking about off the air. It's fresh on the brain. Uh, we're talking about Forbidden Door. We're going to try to get through the card. Uh, actually, we're not going to get through the card itself because it's too long, but we're going to highlight a couple matches that I want to talk about. First match I want to talk about is the banger that's going to be that bad man. Okay? That bad dude. Oh, Kata versus Brian Danielson. Already he's getting a five star. That's my match of the week. It didn't have to happen yet because it's going to be a <laughs> banger. All right, my hottest wrestler of the week. Okay, oh, Kata, coldest wrestler of the week because guess what? He takes the whole thermometer. Oh, Kata. <laughs> right. oh, no, I got a question. Real what? quick. Yes, sir. Now, what if happens like five minutes into the match, like one of them breaks their legs? It's still going to be the Why would you put that out there? Exactly. I'm just saying. It's it's, it's, it's Planned Parenthood. (laughs) Anything can happen. They always get hurt. That's made out of wood. (laughs) I don't. I don't. I'm not wishing it on either one of the two because I do Uh. like those guys. I'll that match is dropped through bad. Let me tell you something. That coin dropped all right on, on Dynamite. Do you know how I popped like a 10-year-old boy popped for John Cena in 2006? Boy! Come on now. You said that this show is stacked and it's fire. Yeah, There's that's the nothing. only match I'm looking forward to. You're that's crazy. It. Nope. You're, nope. That's it. In, that's it. No, bro. Nope. Don't want to see anything else. Oh my God. I'm good. Man, you're wild. Go ahead, Cliff. Get, get, go ahead and you can say some stuff. Because <laughs> Damien, Damien is like, oh, it's the gimmick. What? I get it, bro. I get it. It's the gimmick. No, the gimmick. I'm being, the gimmick. I, I, I understand. You, 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 someone's got to hate the show. Someone's got to hate it. I, I'm Me, being, I, I, I'm being I, dead I, ass honest. I, I tried to fence. Cliff's more, more so the time. He's a little, he's a little more, li- uh, you know, liberal AEW than 
His money. <laughs> I, mean, I cross the fence here and there. Sometimes I'm radical AEW. Sometimes I'm radical AEW. But you, you are just straight hey AEW. You, you, you're the conservative. You're a WWE guy. Look, look you've I enjoy it. Look, you cannot tell me though. No. You cannot tell I... me that Tan- Ta- Tanahashi and MJF is not about to be a banger after MJF has put on banger after banger after banger, totally stealing his shtick. But seriously, uh, you cannot sit there and tell me that that match won't be fire regardless. Regardless of ten, years ago, ten years ago, <laughs> ten years ago. You're telling me Tana Hot Tana Hockey Jersey. Still? You're not. <laughs> I had to sign up for me. I saw the I saw I look, I watched the match that he had on On Dynamite with on did you watch with Collision with Swerve? Yes. Watch, and that was banger. Fire. Fire. It was all right. It was You're all right. crazy, Damon. You are literally crazy. It was I. Right. It was I. Right. It was I. Right. And I enjoy Collision. Actually, I've enjoyed both episodes. So ha, ah. ha. Ah. But that I didn't enjoy that much. Sorry. You're wilding. That match was. You saw what? Besides, besides Sheamus and and Solo, what's a what was a better match this week? That wasn't on yeah. WWE. It is. I'm, I'm gonna make it. I'm gonna put, I'm gonna make it harder for you. Um, besides, besides Seamus and Solo, because I, I, I enjoy, I enjoy, I enjoyed, uh, was it Buddy and oh, Andrade? Okay. okay. Yeah. Oh, that was that, yeah. Like last, last week, week last week on collision. I told you I enjoyed collision. The only thing I was like, eh, was Wardlow and Lisa Soros. Everything else was fucking awesome, including the women, including the women that, that that tag team women's match it was good. Speaking of the women, so you, so look at this: Tony Storm and Willow. Are you going to tell me that's not about to be banger? Because they're going to okay. get them. They're, right, they're, they're going to get time. I forgot that was on. I forgot that was on there. Actually, mm-hmm. see, look at you, look at you, look at you, look at you. I said I forgot that it was on there. It'll be I. Right. Should be good, but I, I'm good. I don't want to sit in the front of my phone for like eight hours. I agree. This man said in the front <laughs> of his phone though. Yeah. Hey, oh yeah, I'm not putting not that on my TV leave. or computer. <laughs> yes, I'm not putting that on my. Yo, I was like, <laughs> we don't condone streaming of any kind. Look, here look, look all I'm saying you know, is, no, like, I do not take that into my house. Oh, you're crazy. This show's about to what? Be, you're, this show's gonna be a banger. This, this show is. This card is booked five stars. Like all the way from the zero, from the from the zero buy-in out, whatever they call it, the zero hour. Oh, like, yeah, yeah. Athena and, okay. Athena and Billy Starks are going to like that's going to spank. Uh, okay, okay, Meltzer. The, I'm yeah. not Meltzer. This is <laughs> it is. This man out here about to get nine and a half stars. Oh, <laughs> uh, it is. Watch you watch. Kenny's going to get the like best match of the night, and it's not going to be. But Chaz right. is going to be. Chaz is going to say it, though. Chaz can be like, "Yo, you see that match? Will Osprey, Kenny Omega. That's right. Ten and a half out of five stars." I'm not in the first. Of all, I'm not going to do that. <laughs> You're wilding. First of all, Listen, I like last, I like, last time. These guys, no, 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 no. I like. No, I no, like no, no, no. You got your time to talk. It's my time. It's my time now. You get to talk. Last time we watched this happen in New Japan, you were like. All over Twitter, <laughs> like, oh my god, this match! <laughs> oh my god, god, this was so good. I'm it not saying was. it's not gonna be, but it don't, was. Don't, 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 don't downplay. Don't downplay. Like, I'm you're not, not downplaying. <laughs> I'm not downplaying anything. I'm just saying that I twelve and a half out of five stars. Yellow, well, no, no, no. <laughs> it is just if the parameters are set to five stars, it's going to get either five stars. Like, I'm not doing that. I'm not Melsler. Like, 15 it, and a half stars. <laughs> but you're forgetting it wasn't in the Tokyo Dome. It's in Canada, so it doesn't count. So, well, if, no. Yeah. I, mean, if I it's like in the Tokyo Dome, it already gets two stars. All spray gets full credit. And I, I hit and miss with Kenny because it's it's Kenny. Um, but all spray is, is legit the best on the one of the best on the planet. Uh, it is, it, 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 he is just the his presentation, how like. Bro, when he was on Twitter, he went to it was like Niagara Falls, and him and his and his and his girl. He, <laughs> he's like, I spit blood. <laughs> like the joint's funny. Like he's bruh, y'all, are, Kenny and Osprey about to spank. Osprey's gonna get his dub and get his title back and go back to Japan because Kenny's not going back. Uh, what else is on this? Let's look at this. Uh, oh yeah, Sonata and and Jungle Boy smack. Yeah, I'm I'm good. 
I don't want to see Jungle Boy do nothing but wow. leave wrestling. Oh my god! Get over Damn. What? Get over what? He don't like wrestling. He needs to go. Yeah. I didn't, you know. Uh, oh yeah, the Blackpool Combat Club, and um, well, that's not. That's gonna be a cluster. No, I'm, actually, uh-huh. I'm, like, I'm, I'm actually kind of looking forward to the combat. The, the combat, combat. In, in the in versus the elite and and each yeah. and all that. Uh, any, that's any uh, that ten man tag match, yeah, that that'll be my my. All right, let me go do something else while I yeah. watch this match. That's that'll crazy. be about Ishii, taking a nap. Ishii about to Ishii about to tear it down. Oh, Ishi, listen, that's. I only like Forbidden Door. No, I'm not gonna say that, but I do like when I like New Japan. I like strong style. Okay. But I do too, but they get a little soft when they come to AEW. That I'm, well, not always. That's not true. Anyway, uh Kojima and CM Punk. Okay. That's going to be fire. Uh it did, yeah, the international championship match, Orange Cassidy and Shibata and Zach Saber Jr. and Daniel Garcia. Yeah, you I'm good. You good. What? I'm good. I, I don't legit thought like, you threw your phone there for a second. I'm not gonna front. Look, look, I'm good. I'm good. What? I'm what's not. The, you know, I don't like that man. What? What? Are you, what? What's your? What's your match of the, uh, the week, guys? What's the match of the week? <laughs> well, we did have a show last week, so my match of the week from last week, though, I definitely want to talk about it as uh, MJF and Adam Cole. Yeah, I agree for last week. Yeah, that was that was my match of the week. It won't be Damien's because he's you know anything AEW is just he, he won't get actually it the, credit. the main event of fucking collision. I enjoyed that very much though. So. Uh, uh yesterday's? Wait, no, uh, the, the, the week before. Oh, okay, week okay. Before. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, the, oh, the with uh, Punk and Punk, uh, CMFTR, yeah. or whatever they call it. Yeah. yeah. The tag. Okay. I enjoyed yeah. that. That was actually a very good match. I will give that to them. I told you I enjoyed Collision, dude. I'm going to tell you, my match of the week for this week, though, was um, actually, and I know everybody going to be like, what, what? Uh, Seth Rollins and Braun Breaker. Ah, okay. I like that match. I like that match, too. That was my the match, match was of the week. Fire. That was my match of the week until Tanahashi and Swerve put on the best wrestling of the week, period. So Tanahashi almost dies. He didn't almost die. He was perfectly yeah, he did. fine. He was fine. I saw the I saw those bad knees. He was fine. I saw those <laughs> bad knees. Dude, check, Man, your just, like, check your knees. Check your knees. Oh, my knees are great. <laughs> check your knees. Talk my knees about, are beautiful, talk actually. About, talking about Tanahashi. Knees. I yeah. saw he's like he's like five steps slower. It's all good though. Mm. I still fucked with him. That's still my boy. My match of the week this week was uh, as I said. Swerve and Tanahashi last night on Collision. <laughs> tore sorry to hear that. I, I, I'm not. I don't know why you're sorry. It was fire. <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm sorry to you. hear that. I'm sorry that you didn't, that you can't you can't enjoy great wrestling. I enjoy Damn. great wrestling, sir. I, if you, if I mean, I don't know how you don't enjoy Tanahashi <laughs> and Swerve from last night. Mm, it was all right. That was a, that was a bang. That was a banger opening for a banger show. I mean. There's nothing to write home about. Oh man! <laughs> see, see, see. Do you see? You got you, you. You have you have animals disagreeing with you. I have everybody disagreeing with me. What's your point? True statement. Let's move on. <laughs> <laughs> Let's move on to something a lighter topic for Damon. Let's talk about the WWE guys. That's crazy. <laughs> we don't even get our own temp check. Like that's wilding out. Well, we're going, I was going to wow. do. Temp check. I was going to do temp check after that, but we can do temp check now. I'm trying. He. I'm trying to change the show up, guys. Make it you know less predictable. But temp check. How's the temperature <laughs> like over there, Cliff? Why don't uh, you take it's, over? It's uh very stuffy where I'm at, but that's because I'm around a lot of boxes. Oh. Uh, <laughs> yo, let's uh, uh let's go. My uh, let's go. With my coldest wrestler of the uh, of the week so far, right? I'm gonna have to be honest, man. Uh, Jungle Boy is, is is right there, man. Like he's just he's not he's not in there. But uh, take it to the other side. Let me talk about my hottest wrestler wrestlers of the week. Uh, I'm gonna be honest, man. I'm becoming a fan of theirs, even though I know they're a heel team and I'm not supposed to be. Uh, I'm kind of liking the Gun Club right now. Yeah. <laughs> so. I was highly upset 
when I was like, I had the same thing. I was like, bro, why am I starting to like these mans? Like, <laughs> I, like I was like, maybe it's it's it's, it's, the, it's the heel in me because I just I I enjoy great heel heel work and oh, and I just I got so mad and I was like, why are they? Why why is it just oh? So I, I I can I can agree with you on that. The Gun Club is growing on me. Um, yeah, man. <laughs> <laughs> like uh so 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 simple so cheesy but just the way the presentation of it it works uh, look at damien's face see look at him he's probably like it's dumb it's stupid that's corny like uh it is. No, no, they're doing their thing <laughs> exactly. no, they're doing their thing uh -huh. i ain't mad at him what's your temp check brother jericho guys uh, <laughs> it's always jericho i figured that well, you yeah, yeah. Sometimes. You, I mean, Tony Khan was one was one week. I yeah, he that. was, he was. But since Collision was good, which it seems like he had nothing to do with, I'll keep him off the list this week. So, <laughs> who's, I mean, your, I say, who's your hottest? I will have to give it to the Usos. Okay. Mm. See, 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 see. You see, you see. Mm. What? You see who his coldest? What? Where, where, where's his coldest wrestler work at? I don't give a fuck if he was in AEW, New <laughs> Japan, WWE, MLW, Impact. The nigga's sucking right now. <laughs> Needs to hang it up. You've been and fuck Chris that. Jericho. You've been saying that for a year and a half. <laughs> oh, they up there lying to his wife, getting himself in trouble. Yeah, I was actually was having the conversation about Jack. I was just like, I used to like this guy. Like, I used to model everything. Like, <laughs> Chris Jericho. Um, I will like, never do another Chris Jericho move in my life. Oh man, don't you? Who are you telling? And I want to do. <laughs> I want and I, I want to do the Judas effect so bad. I thought about that one point in time. I remember you talking one about point that. In too. Time, yeah, one point in time. Happy I didn't. <laughs> but. All right, yeah, my I'm gonna hit all the Chris Jericho moves. Yeah, <laughs> of course you are. <laughs> of course I just you like, are. I am Judas Effect, baby. <laughs> Kick out at one. <laughs> Kick, get out, get out, get out. All right, my hottest wrestler of the week. I'm gonna go my hottest wrestler. That Where bad <laughs> man. Oh, that's my Tesla! ear. That man, that man, that man. I hope you lose your voice. That, <laughs> I hope second, you do too. <laughs> when Brian Danielson came out there and was talking all that trash, I, I, I just knew. I knew that that bad man was not going to take all this disrespect. He let Brian off the uh, off the past couple of weeks, make him feel big about himself. Cause you know Brian's a small guy. You know we're small guys. Mm -hmm. We got the we got the biggest mouths. So, you know, he let he let it fester for a little bit. He let him think he wasn't going to show up. Okada came in and whipped that boy ass. Had that boy running. Ah, I hope Brian running. fold his ass he up. Okada's going to, going to prove to Brian why he was in the WWE and why he never stepped foot in Japan because he was scared. He wasn't oh, ready. Oh, okay. Until he folds his only ass one up. Other per Listen, there is, you wish, you wish. There's only one he other him and wrestling. Him up. All right? It's Carmelo Hayes. He's him. But guess what? All right, there is another him. All right, and his name is Ketchka Okada. So that until he gets him. folded up in UPS not, back to Japan, he's, you know what? He is going to get. He's he is going to go back to Japan. The winner, okay? In a box. He's not. <laughs> he's going to get folded. He's going Fold to. It. He's going to send Brian and his head to Bree, uh, Bree Bella, right, and his little daughter Birdie. All right. A, he's, man, got an, he's got another kid. kid. Oh, yeah, he do got he's another got, kid. I forgot about that. Wow. Yeah, that oopsie kid. baby. That oopsie, the oopsie baby. The oopsie baby. The one, yeah, the one that Bree didn't want. <laughs> what? She didn't look happy. No, you're right. She didn't. <laughs> you, didn't you didn't see Total Bells? Uh, no. I don't, I don't watch that. I don't watch uh, that. No, I came across a clip. She did not look happy. She was not I happy. Watch I only watch one trash reality show at a time, and uh, Bella is definitely not on there. 
Yeah, I don't you blame you. Garcia, you get, you Twins, get whatever they go don't, by now. Don't you watch? Don't you watch The Bachelor? No, 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 no. My wife watched The Bachelor. I, I oh. legit this last season full transparency for those. Make fun of me in the comments if you want to. I don't really give a damn. Uh, I watched that Vanderpump because of the stuff that was going on, on Twitter, and you know it was worth. Every bit of my time to watch that go down. <laughs> that thing was insane. Listen, it, you can't write like you could write no, this, no. but for a reality show where a girl breaks up with her fiance, then sleeps with a or makes out with a dude who's married, then sleeps with a guy, makes out with his best friend, only to go back and sleep with that that, that dude. That is scandalous. <laughs> like, <yo. laughs> And she has that to go sounds like and me in my teenage years. Hey, and then she, the girl, the girl who was going around sleeping, right, and making out with other dudes who were married, by the way. That's the other part. That's the catch to this. They were married. They were in a front. They were in a big circle group. They were married. Uh, she put a restraining order on one of the girls and tried to get the restraining order lifted before the reunion show, and it didn't happen. So they had to they had to keep the girls a hundred yards apart from each other. It was. Glorious to watch. This flame, this flaming bird was amazing to watch. <laughs> I inquire all of you guys go check it out. <laughs> anyway, that back sounds hilarious. Back to wrestling. <laughs> it was so bad. It was so good. Sounds like a day in the life of some some Baltimore head rat. But all right, keep going. <laughs> Who came back from Los Angeles at one time? <laughs> <laughs> Possibly. <laughs> I don't know who that is. I've never seen. I've never heard about the person. I've only heard rumors. <laughs> yeah, so I won't say his name. Money in the bank. <laughs> <laughs> Back to wrestling. Okay. Yeah. <sighs> Y'all are crazy. <laughs> yeah, money in the bank. I'm looking forward yeah, to that bank. next week. Yeah, money. yeah, we got some good fire. Up. Money in the yeah. bank. Yeah. So, we're gonna <laughs> Logan Paul. Was... <laughs> Las Vegas betting betting odds came out, and uh, Logan Paul uh, came out as the top the oh. top, uh, top person for uh, for odds of winning money in the bank. So I guess oh, who's where Chad is trying to go is, So you have Shinsuke Nakamura, you have right. Rich Shea. You okay. have uh, Logan Paul, of course. All right. Uh, L.A. Knight. Um, okay. Santos Escobar. Uh, Santos okay. Escobar. Damien Priest and, and Butch. There you go. Okay. Who should win the money in the bank? Thank you, Cliff. <laughs> You're welcome. <laughs> this, is the, this, is the co- this is what the co-pilot does. <laughs> so who do, we, who do you think should walk out of money in the bank with the briefcase? Uh, we'll start with you, Damien, then Cliff, and then I'll go. Oh, I need to mute my mic and laugh some more. <laughs> <laughs> he really is. <laughs> on audio. He really did mute his mic. <laughs> yes, he did. Uh, uh, I think LA Knight should win this. I I I think it's I think it should be him. I yeah. no offense to Logan Paul or like really anybody else in that match but I just feel like he's either him or Damian Priest but if I had to choose between the two it's definitely LA Knight uh listen there's only yeah. one name there's only one name that, that deserves to win at the end of the night at Money in the Bank and his yeah. name is LA Knight <laughs> yeah yeah <laughs> so yeah, I think we all can agree on the board that it should be L.A. Knight. Yeah. Uh, I, thought, I, thought, I thought we were going to play. I don't um, think it would be shocking if Logan Paul wins. That's where I, I wanted to caveat with is that I don't – I don't not see them putting it on Logan just because of the fact that Logan is a star outside. He's a, he's a legit a global phenomenon. Putting yeah. the money in the bank briefcase on him looks good. Let him carry no, it. Out. His brother does actual fights, you know, in the UFC and does you know boxing fights. Let him go around with you know with that briefcase promote the brand. It makes sense. <laughs> no, I mean no. It, as far as like money, eyes on product. Yeah, that's the way to go. But 
And it will and legit when he does do the cash in the surprise cash in, it will be even more shocking because you're not going to know he's going to be there. He's not there I mean, every week. So it would be even more shocking because you're not know, oh wow, I forgot that he was there. He exists, you know. Like I forgot yeah. Logan Paul existed for a minute until they said, Hey, well, he's coming back. It's like, oh yeah, he is there, isn't he? So oh. I don't don't, don't be shocked if it, Logan Paul is Mr. Mahomes. I won't. No, I wouldn't either, that's but the, that's just... the real thing. It should either be LA Knight or Damian Priest. If you want to swerve us, and, and I'd say if you want to do a swerve pick, no pun intended, you go with Butch. Right? Okay. That'd be a nice shot. See, that'd be a shot. You want to swerve mm-hmm. everybody? You put in Cameron Grimes, let him take you to the moon. No, that's just, that's just bad. Uh, I, hey, listen, they did it for Brock. Brock was even in the match. He just walked up the ladder and took some brief. Yeah, they, they totally did. They but totally again, did. I have, to, I have to have the same. I remember the conversation. The name Brock Lesnar. Cameron Grimes. Ew, ew, it, much respect <laughs> to Cameron Grimes. All right. He be cooking. It, it don't even out. If anything, it, you put Cameron Grimes on the scale. He's just. <laughs> Well, that's not fair. Because Brock's almost three. Brock's over three hundred pounds. That he's not even close to that. That wouldn't. That's not what I meant. <laughs> but <laughs> he's taking you literally, pal. Yeah, and you, uh, you just. It's, yeah, it's not fair. But it's not fair. still, <laughs> um, it'd be a great way to intro him, though. That like, I know, like, that'd be like nice. that's that's a great way to like fire start his career. Just like give him the money to bring pain. Yeah. Let him hold that joint for a year. Yep. And ultimately, I mean, it's gotta, good for anybody to be yeah. anybody in that match. It's a very helpful tool, like all of them. If you really want to keep it a, you know, keep it a hundred, like any one of those guys that's in the match, including Logan Paul, it's like they would deserve it. They've all been I grinding. Think, I think the only thing I have a problem with though is that they're putting. So Ricochet essentially is the person who's replacing Kofi Kingston as in the guy who's going to do like the big spot. And like, sure. you know, before that it was Shelton Benjamin, right? Like he's just that dude. And like, I would love to see Ricochet win money in the bank. Personally, you know, I think LA Knight's going <laughs> to win, right? But I would love to see Ricochet win, right? Because I think the guy's put in so much work. He's gotten so much better in his character. His promos have gotten a lot better. And then you reward someone like that, right? Because they did it. And I, and I know a lot of people probably like crap on a. No, no shit on this, right? But when Nikki A.S.H. came through with that new gimmick, right, that superhero gimmick, like, the WWE kind of put a little bit of a rocket behind her and got her to, you know, put her to the women's title because they're so proud of the hard work that she put in. But uh, I think I think something like this would help with Ricochet because, like, Ricochet is a, is, is a top-tier talent, and I feel like they just keep – they're like, well, yeah, you're good enough to be the mid-card and be in the conversation, but uh, we'll, just, we'll just keep sticking with other guys. And I think Ricochet – it should be Ricochet's time to to win. That'd be dope. I'm with it. I'm 100% with that. The man's uh, very, very talented. Very, very accurate, too. Yes. And anything like, you ask that man to do, he's able to do. Whether it's on the ground yeah. or yeah, on the mic. Like, he's getting so much better. I'm like, bro, he's just yeah, he he's doing amazing. He is. He is. I mean, he wasn't... <laughs> wasn't horrible to begin with though <laughs> nope. that's the thing he like he like but he's adjusted very 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 well to the wwe system and how they do things yep and then he can tell like, his ex-girlfriend yo check out what i got <laughs> right <laughs> <laughs> welcome to the main roster <laughs> <laughs> welcome to the main roster where my new girlfriend will be announcing me as the money in the bank winner <laughs> Oh, oh, I forgot they're not dating anymore. Yeah. <laughs> oh, shit. I totally forgot about that. Yo. <laughs> oh. Oh, man. Ricochet's just going through him, isn't he? He is. <laughs> he, he sure is. <laughs> wow. How many? That's three different women, I think, in WWE that he, since he's been there. Yeah. Wasn't he, he, was da- he was dating Tessa. Yeah. yeah, and then That's it right. was what? Then it was uh, what's their name? Caden. 
Katana. Katana Chance. Casey, but React. Yeah. Casey. Yeah. Uh, um, and then now, what's the announcer's late the chick's name again? I keep forgetting her uh, name. Yeah, I forget her name. I keep forgetting her damn name. Um, but yeah. Yeah, now I forgot. <laughs> I totally forget. I keep forgetting her name because she's so new. I keep forgetting her name. And she's like not new, new, but you know what I mean. Yeah, no, no, no. It's funny because like every time I see one of the new female announcers, they're usually like hooked up with one of the dudes like that's in that top tier kind of system, and then like they just they leave. You know, when you look at like remember JoJo when she right before she met, she was a break. Yeah. And, uh, yeah. What was it? Uh, I think it was Cody's Cody's wife, uh, Brandy. 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 Yeah, Brandy. Then she got with Cody, and now you're looking at uh, you're looking at her as well over there with Ricochet. It's like, dang, dude. all y'all. But no, but yeah. So I think I think Ricochet Rick, Ricochet's my dark horse for for this this year. I think I'm gonna go with Butch as my dark horse. Just because, like, either Ricochet or him would be pretty dope. Yeah. I mean, I'd only say why I say Butch is because he's put up with the name Butch for so long. <laughs> yeah, yeah. You know what I mean? And he's it's doing, true. he's he's out there doing the, doing the job. Yeah. Oh, yeah. So that'd be a good gift. <laughs> yeah. Along with a name hey. change, please. Hey, hey, uh, Butch, lose the Butch. We're going to go back to Pete. Pete <laughs> I can't wait till they do that. I can't wait till they finally do that. Bruh, have him, bro. Have him in that joint. Have him cash in. Next night he goes. All right, my name ain't Butch. <laughs> <laughs> my name's Pete Dunn, and I'm the Bruiser Weight. <laughs> and then just walk away, and that's it. I'm the that, Bruiser that, Weight champion. Like, that'd be fire. See, that's all he do. He's like, I'm the bruiser weight. And then just, yeah, I'm the bruiser weight champion. Boom. And he yeah. tells people, only my friends call me Butch. That way, it kind of still keeps a cotton. Yeah. Like, just, like, just like the whole Meechin thing. Dude, he acts like a Butch, though. That's the funny part about it. He do. Even he though do. he's not that tall, he acts, he acts like his name is Butch. Like, <laughs> I don't you know. know he does his like a rabid little <laughs> bulldog. <laughs> A rabbit bulldog named Butch. Mm-mm. All right. What you got for me, Cliff? This or that? Oh, it's funny because we have a women's match still. We have a women's match still? The women's money in the, the bank. The money in the bank. Oh, you're right. I... <laughs> <laughs> wow. <laughs> the wow. This is, yo, this is a man who legitimately is talking. Like, I give so much about, I talk about the women's wrestling so much. And, and you literally brought up about Willow. And uh, Tony Storm's match tonight did not remember there was a women's Money in the Bank match totally also happening. Forgot. Totally forgot. That's crazy. Totally forgot. I can't lie because I can't remember who's in the match. Let's see, uh, I I have it up. So, who do you think? Yeah, for the women. Sorry, uh, Zelina Vega, Becky Lynch, Zoe Stark, Bailey, Io Sky, and Trish Stratus. Ooh. Ooh. Mm-hmm. It's either going to be EO. No. EO's my uh, dark horse. EO's my dark horse. I see her most likely. I feel like I don't feel like it's gonna be Trish or Becky. They're gonna be too busy. I think it's going to be Bailey. It could be. I think Bailey's going to win it again. And if not Bailey, it's either Bailey or Zoe for the very reason why Trish and Becky are too busy. I can see that happening. Yeah, I think I'm going to go with Zoe. So I, I just see. If I wouldn't like Zoe win it. If you're, like, if you're Zelina's, in, story, Zelina's in there to take the big bump, the crazy bump, and fold because Zelina's good at that. <laughs> oh, I like her. I don't want her to fold. Z- Zelina can <laughs> spell her tail off, and it looked like yeah, kind of can. like how Sasha, how uh, sorry Mercedes does, bruh. Like they look like they just fold and like they just little, like, little, die very well. It can't like, legit. Their bodies are like, 
<laughs> and they just and they do it and they do it safely. So Zelina, that's what Zelina's in there. She's gonna take the big bump off the off the ladder with with EO because EO uh, folds very well too. Um, <laughs> she, does she does die very well. Oh right? my goodness! So there, uh, really that's why uh, I see it's got. Uh, I would love for EO to win. I think that'd be cool for EO. Cause be I pretty think, dope for you. But I think it's going to be Bailey because the EO and because damage control is about to, you know, hit the hit sure. five fourteen. So the about you know uh-huh. that's breaking up sooner rather it than it would later. go more it'd go more south if EO won. But we can go as like Bailey <laughs> cost EO. That could happen. Would, See, that and that's why I'm think, going. That's why I think Zoe wins. Because Becky and uh, Trish have their thing going on, right? Then you have EO going up to try to win win the money in the bank. And then all of a sudden, uh, Bailey like pushes the ladder, which also has uh, Zelina on there. And so it just comes down to Bailey and uh, it comes down to Bailey and Zoe. And Zoe, you know, obviously cheats to win. And she gets the money in the bank. Yeah. The, 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 knowing, knowing how they do Bailey, that's probably what'll happen. Oh, no. Did we totally forget about somebody? Who? Who's all in the match again? Zelina, Becky, Trish, Bailey, Zoe, and EO. Oh, why did I think there was some one more person? That's because WWE added uh, Logan Paul in the match. They added somebody. Uh, that's why. That's, oh, that's why. <laughs> oh, okay. I, okay. No, Damn, yeah, I no. Know, even like a bitch. <laughs> God damn. Logan gets special treatment as everyone else qualified. He just goes, I'm in the match, man. The main event of Money in the Bank is going to be fucking epic. Oh, the Bloodlines of War? Yeah. Bloodlines of War? Yeah. Yeah, that's going to that's gonna be, uh, gonna be something, something. Yeah. I feel oh. like this is the first time that it's been an awesome Owen main event. Right? Huh. Huh? Oh, like, I, I don't right. know of another one. No, I think you're right. Yeah. Maybe. I don't know. No, no I got to think about that. No, I feel, maybe. Uh, maybe. Uh. Well, well, no, I think, like, we did get a random question. We have a random question? Yeah. So, random question says, if you could choose any celebrity to see get tickled, who would it be? Oh. Okay, that just got weird. Twitch, what's up, guys? <laughs> you know this uh, is a wrestling podcast, right? Right. Uh, they say I say Justin Bieber as he's quite arrogant and he'd hate it. LOL. That just that came in the chat too. Uh, yeah, this is a this is a wrestling podcast. So for me, uh, I'm gonna go with uh, I I want to pick a wrestler. So yeah, I'm I gonna can, pick one. Too. I want to see. I want to see Mercedes Mercedes uh, Valderando, Valderando, uh get tickled because <laughs> uh, I know she ain't a fan. <laughs> I'm not answering that question. Bet. Big Show. You get- what? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, well, that's I think great, that'd though. be fucking hilarious. <laughs> Can you imagine? Oh yeah, no big ass mouth of his. Too. Ah! 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 <laughs> right, his big ass arms flailing. He might knock somebody <laughs> out. <laughs> big old arms and legs just to going. No, we, no, we're not talking. About it. Yeah, we just gotta. A no. wrestler tickles would be funny. <laughs> All right, thanks, Emma. Thank you for watching. Make sure you subscribe, yeah. Emma. Please subscribe. Uh, follow us on your favorite social media. Uh, Site too while you're at it while uh, you're asking us these all right up there questions yep uh <laughs> this or that hey so really i wanted to ask this question uh, a couple weeks ago okay well, uh, a couple episodes back but, but we I, did I, it i had a feeling you were going to do what i the discourse that was on wrestling twitter the past couple of hours no no, no i've been paying attention because i've been oh, too busy packing, packing. <laughs> No, but really, I wanted to talk about this. I think this is a great conversation, and we would have a lot of fun with it. Uh, so this is that. I want to talk about best wrestling fans, right? And so we're going to go with Chicago. Oh. Or are we going to go with, and this is going to be crazy, New York City. 
Actually, I'm sorry. Philly. That's what I was thinking of originally. Philly and Chicago. Philly? Hmm. I hate Philly. <laughs> but they're a hype-ass crowd, though. They are a hype-ass crowd. I hate Philly. Like, for all... Like, this is... Both both places is for pretty much all wrestling. Like, you yep. go there, you're going to have a good crowd. I hate so, Philly. So... I look, I didn't say I was too fond of it either. I'll be there next I'll be there next year and I'm gonna let everybody I'll be there next year. And I'll make sure that everybody knows that I hate that place. I, I don't feel them. like I don't feel like flying all the way across the country just to be in Philadelphia. Like oh, no, I already we, gotta do we, it to go to Maryland. Yeah, no, you gotta be you'll be there too, cause 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 yeah, I'm going to make sure that every person in Philadelphia knows that the Eagles choked. And they choke, and they're gonna choke again that in the year after because they're gonna choke again this year. All right? Oh, and how, oh! You really don't like Philly, do you? Oh no! no what did Philly to. do to you? They you have existed. a bad time in Philly. They did you existed. catch something from a Philly they bitch? Existed? No, I damn. <laughs> no, no. Good. That's good to know. He's looking yeah. down to make sure. <laughs> <laughs> No, he's like, no. oh man. I'm gonna go with yeah. Chicago. I'm gonna go with yeah. Chicago, though. I'm going with Chicago as well. Yeah, I'll never, okay. I'll never pick Philly for anything. Yeah, I was, I, I it was a really close Chicago. to me. Yeah, I yeah, want to lean towards Chicago, but it's it's so hard for me to pick to not pick Philly, right? And I said because like obviously with ECW, we know that the historic venue, but one night only definitely had like major pops, and even recently when it, when. when AEW WWE has been coming through. Like they've been, they've been a loud, boisterous crowd. Like they've let you know, like yeah. how they're feeling. But it's that yeah, Chicago it crowd. Every time that I see AEW or WWE in Chicago, that crowd is always, always, always electric. So I'm like, it's hard for me not to pick Chicago overall. So I don't know. I really they like, like the, they like they some wrestling. They, they sure, love their they sure do love that wrestling, man. They be getting the wrestles on. Yeah. I but it doesn't it. matter what we think. What do y'all think? Let us know in the questions and tweet at us. You know which city the city has the better wrestlers. And if you're from before Philly, you suck. And before you <laughs> ask, Tony Khan grinds my gears. There you go. All righty, then that kills the well, then there it goes. <laughs> If you reach to the end, this point of the episode, you get a tr- <laughs> you get a trophy for my PlayStation users and my Xbox users. You get an achievement. All right. You've made it to the end of the movie, all right? And it is now time for the end credit scene, which is follow us, subscribe, do all that. Hit that bell button, okay? Oh. Check out our other content called Now Into the Ring, all right? Interviews always coming out, all right? And we might got one come out tomorrow. You never know. But if you know I know how you'll know is if you hit that bell button because you'll get a notification because I got the that bell is true. And I get the notification, so I know. That yeah. I know that you will know when an episode drops. So hit that bell button. Okay. Also, if you like that hat that Cliff's wearing, buy it. Okay. It's hot. It's fire. It's authentic snapback. Ain't no cheap trucker hat. All right. It, that's a that's a snapback. Okay. Where's like, my hat? Uh, where's my, where? Uh, it's, it's, where's know. my hat? Oh, where's my hat? I gave you my address. Where's my hat? You already said you're going to send me a hat, so um, you can't I just, back out of that. No, you can't back out of it no, now. I, no, I'm not backing no. out of that. There's something yeah. else. So thank you for watching. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Bye. Go to the next episode now. <laughs> just do it now. Yep. Just, yep. Don't, just yeah. go just, to the next. Just, just do yeah, it. Get to the next episode. Don't worry about it now. Don't worry about it. Whatever Thank happened you. afterwards, if Chaz returns, Chaz returns. <laughs> Thank you for listening. I love being on the show, guys. So please. This is the episode that's called the one where Chaz just kept laughing the whole episode. Bro, y'all been wild because y'all been wild. Oh, yeah. <laughs> if, you want my, if you want my new shirt, you got to find me on social media. I'm not giving it out. So good luck. I was just like, <laughs> wow. Okay. Yeah, they blow. I'll find my merch on too. Weird. They got to find me. I'm not wearing mine. Nah. Uh-uh. Oh, look I at know. you slacking. 
Oh, okay. I'm, I'm supporting. Like, I'm supporting. So, yeah, as the big pusher of pure ignorance, that's right, <laughs> your boy right here, the Red Dog. I will holla at y'all later. We will see you in a couple weeks or maybe next week or however we're feeling, you know, in the meantime, between time. Peace. We I'm out. The innovator of Duffin season. Yeah. It's a forbidden Always door. Duffin season. Oh, God damn it. I got it. Hey, guys. It's the host of the three count, you know, Chaz Evans here. Make sure to let you know that I don't run shit. I don't do shit. I just talk shit. And uh, make sure you subscribe to our podcast. Um, what else did you do? You should also follow us on all social medias. That's the Facebook at Three Count Podcast, the Instagram at Three Count Pod, and the Twitter at Three Count underscore Pod. Also, if you like us a lot, a lot, you should definitely buy a, a t shirt at prowrestlingtees.com slash Three Count Pod. And that's the number three. Don't be an idiot and type in T H R E E. Because you're not going to find anything. So make sure you follow us at 3CountPod or 3 count underscore pod on Twitter and buy a shirt. Be there or be somewhere else.